Hello scrapbooking ladies, I'm coming today to share a um, challenge giveaway. This is for all my um, loyal subscribers and I have reached 200 plus subbies so I'm going to do a challenge giveaway. I thought this would be the best um, way to do a giveaway versus just leave a comment and win a bunch of stuff because sometimes it seems um, there are those that um, just kind of subscribe to channels to enter random giveaways and don't really even use the stuff they get. So um, my challenge to you is to create a car layout or altered item and it needs to include these five things. Glimmer mist or some kind of glitter to make it glimmery and shiny. Laces and trims. It has to have a cinnamon on it for a card. And if you're doing a scrapbooking layout, it needs to have journaling on it. I think that's an important part of the scrapbook layout. If you don't have journaling, it really doesn't tell um, a complete story. So you need some kind of um, journaling. I don't care if it's handwritten or computer generated. If you're doing an altered item like a box or something, you can kind of um, you can you know disregard this step, or you can um, maybe add like a um, one word, like a sentiment, like love, joy, peace, something like that on your box or altered item or picture frame or whatever you're wanting to make for this challenge. The fourth thing is it has to have bling, and the fifth is some kind of a homemade flower, either fabric or paper, like using your um, circle punches, scallop circle punch, you can create a f um, flower just by um, use, punching out like eight different scallop circles and put a brad in the center and scrunch them up and that makes a really cute flower using um, Fiskars has some squeeze punches that are flower shaped and punch out two or three of them and stack them up with a brad that's a homemade flower so some kind of a homemade flower on your card layout or altered item and I'll show you what the prize is going to be it's going to be a medium flat rate box that's going to be packed full of goodies for my international subbies I'm going to do a small flat rate box just because of the horrific um, cost for shipping and whatever you see here if there's certain things that you really um, want in your box you can um, let me know and I will add those or if nothing here you see really interests you um, and there's certain things items you're really wanting you can't get where you're at let me know and I'll um, pick those up for you and um, the contest is going to close on October the 5th and then I'll do my um, winner for the giveaway as soon after that as I can. So I'm going to show you what you're going to get. And some of it is kind of a, um, a little bit back to school kind of theme stuff on some of them. Um, but anyway, you're going to get um, these cute pebbles, puffy school stickers. You're going to get these really cute American Crafts journaling stickers called Fork and there's 11 stickers in the packet. You'll get these cute layered embellishments from Pebbles, airplane and the balls. You'll get these cute black and white epoxy paper clips and you're going to get three packages of thickers. These are the hat box in a light pink and these are called text accents they just have you know some fingers and borders and mustache some fun curly cues a thought bubble so you get those stickers and then you'll get a set of the root beer float vinyl white stickers and you'll get a set of butterfly grommets for making memories. You'll get a set of American Crafts recess journaling stickers. There's 11 stickers in the pack. You'll get cordial American Crafts remarks phrase stickers. There's 18 stickers in that pack. You'll get a package of basic gray Indian summer chipboard alphas. You will get a color box page kit, and there's um, 10 papers, 5 layered stickers, 66 stickers, 13 chipboard punch outs, and 35 punch outs. And it 
doesn't say what the collection is. Um, it's kind of a little bit school themed, but the chipboard pieces and the stickers and the paper you could really use. Um, they're pretty versatile. You can use it for anything. So you'll get that. And then you're going to get these um, really cute um, school themed brads. You're going to get an Ikea mirror that you can alter. And you're going to get a three piece set of canvas board that is nine by 12. So you can make some canvases for you and your friends. And you're gonna get the Prima Hello Space Boy pattern paper. There is, oh, it doesn't say how many sheets. So I'll just kind of flip through it quickly. So that's the Prima Hello Space Boy collection. I'm gonna get some paper butterflies and flowers. There's a red set, and then these are varied pastel colors. You're gonna get some Ditto glitter glue, this beautiful turquoise teal color. You're gonna get some in this really pretty green, which would be perfect for like your Christmas. The Ditto glitter glue. And it's really nice. I really like it. You're going to get this cute tree stamp with the little birds um, from Inka Dinka Doo. You're going to get this butterfly flourish stamp from Inka Dinka Doo. You're going to get a couple of Versa Magic chalk inks in white and black. You're going to get a couple of washi tapes bright pink. You're going to get some Adhesive Lace and Roll from Recollections in the purple, red, and another purple one. You're going to get some purple two-tone open roses. You're going to get some poppy seed grand adhesions from Kane Company self-adhesive stickers. Gonna get some Can Company Susan Wing It die cut cardstock that's glitter. And this is some designs. You're gonna get these stencils from Ditto. You're gonna get a package of neutral TPC Studio ink pads in various neutral colors, silver and gold peach, olive, copper, black. You're going to get some of my lavish laces that I bought in the hot pink and the purple colors. You're going to get this really fun background stamp. And then you're also going to get these Ditto Resist chipboard pieces butterflies, flowers, and frames. And last but not least, you're going to get these Tim Holtz Ideology Adornment Classic Charms. So you just need to complete, I'll have the, all the details in the description box below, a card, layout, or altered item with those five things, and post a video response by October the 5th, and I will draw one lucky winner. So. Thank you very much for watching and good luck ladies and thank you for being such loyal subscribers.